Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm super excited about today's video because I'm actually going to be sharing one of my biggest hacks as of lately and I'm just oh, I'm just super super excited because I know a lot of you are going to love this and find it so helpful. What I'm going to be talking to you about today is boobs and breast lift tape. So this video is in collaboration with Perky Girls Tape and I'm so so excited to show you guys how amazing this stuff is and how I've been using it. So if you haven't heard of like a boob tape before it's pretty much like a tape. I'll show you. It's like a roll of tape like that and you can pretty much use it to stick your boobs into place when you can't wear a bra. So, you know when you have like backless dresses or super like plungy bodysuits or tops, um, strapless things, spaghetti straps, just any kind of top or dress or bodysuit that you can't wear a bra because you'd see it and you maybe don't have the boobs or you kind of want a bit of support or a bit of cleavage and that kind of thing. So that's where these bad boys come in super, super handy. My little puppy's crying because he wants to come on the couch. And no, you can't. <laughs> so it comes in two different colors. I've got the black here and the nude. So yeah, you'd use yeah either one depending on what you're wearing. So obviously if you're wearing black, you'd wear the black. Um, and then probably if you're wearing like any other color, you'd stick to the nude. I will be showing you guys with the black today just because you can sort of see it a little bit better. But I will sort of show you guys what comes in the box. So when you purchase it, it comes like that. You get the tape in it. You get some nipple covers in it as well because you do put on the nip covers like that. And then you put the tape over the top. So that's super handy. I love that it comes with these. Um, and then it comes with, yeah, like a little card thing and... A little pamphlet thing that shows you all the different ways to use it now I have only used it that way so number five I've used it like that and I've used it kind of like that and all of them have worked amazing but the, yeah there are so many other uses for it so these are made from 96% cotton and 4% spandex the glue on it is acrylic if you do have sensitive skin you always want to patch test it first I am quite sensitive and I haven't had any issues with it it's latex free it's waterproof as well which I found is super amazing because if you do go out you know it's sweat proof it's not gonna like slide around anywhere I have used like the you know like the little chicken fillet things I had like some little breast lifty things made out of that sort of material like the silicony stuff and they ended up just sliding off I wore them to a festival <laughs> and because I was that hot and sweaty they just slid off so I ended up having to take them off so this is amazing because it is sweat proof and yeah, waterproof, so it's not going to go anywhere. And yeah, even better, you could actually wear it like to the beach or something. You could wear it with swimmers because you could sort of just put it underneath here and then you get like a nice boob lift when you've got your bikinis on. So that's really cool as well. What else does it say on there? 200 inches in a roll. Oh yeah, it doesn't remove your fake tan, which is super amazing. I don't fake tan or like at least I haven't in about a year. So I haven't tried it with fake tan, but apparently it doesn't remove your fake tan, which is absolutely amazing. And it is super easy to remove. I just use a little bit of coconut oil to dissolve it um, to remove. But anyway, let's get started on a bit of a demo, shall we? So I've got my first <clears throat> bodysuit on. And as you can see, this has got like a deep plunge. And as much as I could get away with just wearing it like this, because my boobs aren't massive, I don't really need the support. But I definitely would love just a little bit, a little bit of little bit of a plunge so yeah as you can see I don't really have much going on there without so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab my t why are you trying to get into the TV cabinet mate <laughs> sorry it's really distracting so what you want to do is you want to measure out how much about you need so I'm probably gonna go I'd say about that much so I'm going to cut that off there. So I've cut that off because um, I'm just going to sort of put it over my shoulder and then under like that. So 
I'm going to pop my nipple cover on. And like, you don't have to wear the nipple covers, but at least this way, like, you know, you're not going to get a nip slip or anything like that. So pop him on. And then what you're going to do is you're going to peel back that bit. So it's like super stretchy and thin, which is amazing. So you can really kind of like molds to your body shape and it's not uncomfortable or anything like that. So without flashing my boob, I'm going to, oh, this is like a bit tricky to do on camera. I'm just going to place it right there on the back of my shoulder where my strap will sit. And then you pretty much just slide it down. You go like that. And then you can kind of, I like to kind of just leave like a little bit at the bottom. And then I go to like my actual boob and I will actually place it how I want to put it. So I'd kind of like put it a bit higher. So that's just going to cover my nipple. So as you can see, I'm kind of like pushing my boob in. So I'm kind of pushing that in. I've got a nipple cover on so you guys can't see my nipples, but pushing that in. And then, this is so much easier to do when you're naked, but yeah. And then push that underneath. I don't know if you can notice, but this side is like way more black sitting in. It feels way more supported. Whereas, yeah, I've got no cleavage whatsoever in this boob. Yeah, it's got just, yeah, so much more um, sort of oomph on this side. So I'm going to pop it on the other one and then you'll be able to see how much of a difference it makes when they're both done. So I'm just going to, yeah, cover my boobs. But pretty much what I've done is I just put them on like two little straps and I've just basically pushed my boobs in and up and then I've taped them in place and yeah I can't even like yeah I can't even feel them on they're like super light they're like going with my um body and my curves and my skin and whatever so yeah anyway that is the after with both of them so you can see my boobs definitely look like they've got a little bit of a lift I've got way more cleavage and yeah, they're just like super supportive and they're not like bouncing around anymore like they were before. Um, and yeah, you can even like sort of push them out a little bit more once they're already in the tape and make them nice and yeah, perky and position them however you want. And then I'd obviously go on with adding like a bit of contour and highlighting and all that jazz. So this is the first type of top that I would use the tape for. Okay, another style of tops that I love to wear is these V-cut tops that have got the spaghetti straps so yeah usually with these types because they got the sp spaghetti straps you can't wear a bra because then you'll be, I'd be able to see it um so yeah as you can tell like i don't really have much going on at the moment definitely need a bit of a lift so how i'm going to use the tape for this type of top is i'm actually going to put some on the bottom like this so I'm going to cut off a piece and I'm going to put it on the bottom and I'm just going to lift the boobs up like that. Now I'm obviously going to do that off camera because it's going to be a bit tricky to do that without flashing you in my boobs. <laughs> so that has already pushed them up a little bit. And then I'm going to go in with two smaller little pieces. like that and I'm going to put them like that so I'm going to attach it to the other one there and I'm going to place it up like that so it's going to push my boobs up again and in a little bit so as you can see what I've done there is I've connected it to the bottom and I've just pushed held my boob in with one hand and I've just pushed it up like that and then when I put my top on if you can ever see a little bit of tape like that, you can literally just grab your scissors and cut that little bit off. Then you can't see anything and look at that. Like that has given me so much cleavage. It looks like I'm wearing a bra. Like this side compared to this side, like the top's just kind of falling to the side. And so what that's essentially done is like that. 
So I will do the other side now and then show you what it looks like with both. So as you can see now that I've got both of them done, again, I would then go in with a nice contour, but you can just see how much more cleavage I have. Like that is insane. And like even from the side, I've got, yeah, so much more boob happening. They're feeling so much more supportive and not so saggy. And yeah, perfect. Okay, now the last way I have been loving using this tape is just with a plain old like boob tube. Now, you might say, why don't you just wear a strapless bra? To be honest, I hate wearing bras. They're so uncomfortable. And sometimes you can have a strapless bra that's got a, like a plunge sort of bit, so you actually can't. Or you've got something strapless that's got like a low back or whatever it is. Sometimes you just can't wear a bra. So I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to do it with the strapless. Again, I'm going to do what I did with the bottoms and the sides. So I'm going to pop one on the bottom, then I'm going to pop two little ones on the sides, and then I'm actually going to put another one sort of in the middle just to help give me that lift. So as you can see, I have put one on the bottom, which will do like the first lift. Then I've popped a couple on the sides and that's just going to give me like that pushed in and a little bit more lift. And then I've popped one sort of in the middle and that's really holding the lift up. Now, if you have got like bigger boobs, this will be really good because it just holds them in so well. Even if you did any of the other ones and just did that extra one to give you that extra support, amazing. So I'm just going to pop that over the top and again i've just got a little bit hanging out here so i'm just gonna give that a chop it's so good like that it's fabric because it cuts so easily and now not only do my boobs look so much bigger but they're nice and high nice and supported and yeah, I've just got like a nice amount of cleavage at the top, if you can see that. And yeah, I look like I'm wearing a bra, but I don't feel like I'm wearing one, so win-win. So anyway, that is the three ways that I have been absolutely loving wearing this tape. It is honestly a game changer. You, once you try this, you'll be like, where has this been all my life? If you've tried all the other like silicone or just like the sticky ones and you found that Number one, they don't even do anything. Number two, they fall off. Like, they're just a pain in the bum. <sighs> so we'll off in the background. He's being silky because I'm not giving him any attention. Um, but yeah, this is a life changer. You don't need to be using duct tape and like stripping off your skin. Please don't use that. This is totally safe. Um, and it's waterproof. It's not going to go anywhere. As I said, you can go swimming in it, wear it with your bikinis, give you a little bit of a lift. Yeah, such, such a great product. And I'm so, so, so excited that I found it because it's just, it's changed my life. Honestly, it's been so good. So yeah, if you guys would like to check out Perky Girls, I will put their website and all their links in the, uh, in the, I was going to say in the display box. I'll pop it all down below for you so you can check it out. If you've got boobs, you need this. I don't care how big or small they are. You need this in your life. So, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to pop them down below. Um, or Perky Girls is awesome. You can always message them and they will answer anything. And yeah, that is all from me today. I really hope you found this video helpful and I'll see you all in my next one. Bye!